Hey guys, welcome to Challenge 3. If you missed uh, 1 and 2, uh, the first one died just because of uh, a, a random enemy in the, uh, the Evanstone area, which has a name, I'm sure. The second run died too. Arrow trap. So we'll see if uh, three is our lucky number and we can make it at least to the first boss. Or maybe like an armor set. I don't know, something. We'll make some progress and not be. Nothing. Rip challenge to gone but not forgotten. It was a good run until it wasn't. So I don't think I'm gonna farm too much more. I'll try to just get going as much as I can here. Early recall potion is a godsend. This wood isn't bad, but it is kind of slowing me down. Freshening my vibe. As the famous song goes, please don't steal my vibe. Please don't steal my vibe. I forget the rest of it. Remember it was very respectful. I just made some. So I'd like to get maybe a cloud in a bottle of cactus armor. That's a decent goal. Ah, keeps running out of platforms, which is kind of annoying. Just stop. So the first uh, challenge one was able to make it to having a bed fully built. Uh, this could go poorly, and it probably will. It would be kind of neat to have a uh, actually died to that, that would have been, what well, would have been kind of funny, admittedly. <laughs> I can't fall in the water here because it's cold. a little bit. I don't think that they can go through the platforms. Oh gosh, I fell. Alright, we're fine. We're fine. It's all okay. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. And we have a life crystal for our bravery. Sparking is pretty good. Of course, 
so I'm not going to be using it, probably. But, oh, actually I might. I didn't make a bow yet. Second chest. What am I, the Queen of England? so I can afford to use them, why not? We actually got way more torches than I would have expected from our explorations. It's probably less weird for to use than explorations, but I can't think of any. We have 69 ropes, so once it's night time we can start our elevator. Excavations. Sometimes he really does miss. That was not one of those times. Mega damage. <laughs> Gotta keep farming, I don't wanna waste daylight. The first day is the most important. The more materials we gather, the longer we can be underground. Actually, kind of strong. But you need to get lucky on that. <sighs> Why did you live so long? Got some slimes in the attic, but hey, who doesn't, right? I wonder if the guide arrows can uh, get the day bloom out of the ground. should not run out of wood for a while now.
Look at him sitting in a chair. I'm so proud of him. I don't think he used to be able to do that. Oh, I got a lead anvil. Or lead bars, I mean. I'd say, don't we have a ton of uh, doors? <laughs> There's no way I ran out of materials. Oh, it's just up there. I like it how he moved into that house, but he's still sitting in this house. For some reason. Oh, I know, guide. Trust me, I know how dangerous this world is. Do I have gold? How do I have gold? Must have been a pretty good chest, I guess. I'm a little bit annoyed that I didn't pick up much stone from just digging straight down. There we go. Let me just make sure that I have enough rope to get back up. Dig in a little bit. Oh, if I dig down there, I'm only going to get more water. So 
that adversity makes for a great uh, motivator, whatever it is. Might take a little while. But I mean, it's pretty cool that they made a magic weapon that works without any mana stars. So, a small task. Only delaying the inevitable, but hey, if it's inevitable, why not delay it? No, no, no. Killed me last time. <laughs> Look at that. It's a magic torch. So no super great caves down there, but I should be able to make a furnace, I think, at least. Extra land, very nice. to waste too many torches, so I'll make all that I can. I'll keep some of these in reserve. I'm kind of sleepy. I mean, this is a pretty good start. Could end it here. Just be waiting for night anyways. Around, so I'm never gonna remember to use a grenade. You know what? Oh, the door is locked. I almost died just to being a little, little rabble rouser. <laughs> Closing all my doors. <laughs> it's daytime, I can chase this guy down. Don't you walk away from me. Healed also. That would be a good skill to learn for challenge runs. Pressing the H button. I got so many wood, but I don't have my platforms.
Don't pay me at all. What the heck? Oh, snowstorm. The other way is that it's still not. Maybe I should have waited for the merchant to show. That guy might have too much health. That's a lot. Oh, shit. Seed's kind of trash. But we'll see what I can do. If it would let me through the door. Hello. <laughs> and I got six. have to be one, some can just be ignored. You know what, if I keep this ice slime around, I don't think that they can spawn the scarier enemies. through the water. Worms can't swim. Oh, what the hell. They can. I guess I gotta learn about worms. I can see him coming from here. Does he stop following me? I guess he did. them did kind of make me get slowed, which isn't great. That's okay. We can get a cactus armor now, we can get to the ocean. Uh, ideally anyways. I like that sandstorm that lasted like not at all. Just didn't last. I wish we would let you make wood platforms sooner. We get a water pool.
this. Yep. I know what the the fall damn distance is. I definitely should have waited for the merchant so I could have gotten the Ocean loot's really strong early. But hopefully we'll be able to find some cool stuff. We'll see. We'll see. You never know. Could happen. We made it to the ocean. So that's that's a big goal. I never got to the ocean on the first one, and I didn't get a chance on the second one either. Gosh, is he gonna die to an enemy while he's asleep? I'm wasting ammo because I don't need burn on waterfowl. You wouldn't kill a sleeping man, would you? They might. Now we know that's a thing. Oh my gosh, I can't believe that just happened. Alright, we need a empty spot in my inventory for the glow stick. Whoa. I got so much speed. All of a sudden, I was thinking I could bomb rush it. I want to get in there because I think ocean chests can have good stuff. I don't know if they're guaranteed, but you know they can have good stuff if they spawn. What the fuck is their speed, dude? Expert pink jellyfish are OP. Eventually, they have to die, right? If I hit them enough times, their HP has a cap. Back. Actually, should I even be baiting them? Baiting them does seem to help in hitting them. chest here. Alright, we got Holly, we got the merchant. So, not too bad. Merchant means we can buy a lot of rope for descending into the elevator, which will let us expand our base more. Yeah, three NPCs. The angler might be coming. Uh, probably not. But you never know. It could surprise us. I don't know how he can even sleep while he's on water. Like, who does that? Seems kind of sus. Wanna go? I just killed your cousin. Yeah, come get him. I'm in near your water. Idiot. Maybe calling him an idiot is a bit far. Am 
might be. That glow stick has survived all this time. Piranha could be a problem, we'll see. Is that? Can't really see it too well. That could be a crystal heart. It's hard to see. Gotta say, that was the one time I was not expecting that. Where's that even coming from? There's nothing more tense than waiting for him to spring up for air. arrow drops are pretty good. I do like that statue as well. Alright, if I find one more cave I'll try to find one more key and I'll go to bed. <laughs> Big open cave with golden chests and ancient cobalt armor. The way the uh, lighting effects are looking looks kind of like uh, Okay, this is a pretty clean elevator. On uh, challenge 2 I had to make a kind of a weird one. Is it not daytime yet? Or did it just turn? I can't 
didn't see anything. I might have been digging all day, which would be unlucky. Glowstone is way easier than having to micromanage torches, so I'm glad I got lucky there. Marble, however, is not so lucky. This could potentially kill me. I don't have much experience with it. But it is pretty. I do like marble. I think the enemies can go through walls. So... I can panic recall if I want. slimes, which aren't necessarily the scariest thing in the, in the world. Why are there so many, though? That looks like a heart piece. it is about expert hardcore, but I get so many pinkies. It's actually insane. If you watched the last episode, you know what I'm talking about. Oh, you're so close. The more life we have, the less likely we are to die, I think, if I'm right anyways. <laughs> right, this is looking like a pretty decent sized cave. What? Can I not put it down on that? Aww, it, it grew right in the middle of the minecart thing, so it got rid of a lot of ore I could have gotten. Also, I think that mouse was bait, which is annoying. But it literally killed itself before I could notice its existence, so don't, don't go blaming that on me. Lots of 
lot more than I deserve. Oh my god, the fucking lag. Uh, that was so close. I swear, I just got like backed into a corner and I couldn't move. But we made it to the ocean, got some life crystals, and when it's time for challenge four, uh, we'll hopefully be slightly better. And our elevator was... Oh, I can't go to map anymore? I think it was semi-decent. I don't really have any point of reference though. Thanks for watching.